Hello, and welcome to episode 18 of my Force of Nature tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on completing the quest Create a Portal. So in the last episode I created that portal, and I need to create one more in order to complete the quest. So I'm going to need to pick up some ten stone, clay and sand. So let's do that and complete this quest, because I managed to uh, get enough claws to make all what I needed. Okay, so clay and sand I need, and also some rocks. Where did I put the rocks? Oh, over here, or stone I should say. Okay, so that's all what I need. Let's head on out now. Uh, remember, it shows up on the map, your teleports. So there's the range of the, uh, the teleport. Now, whether that's a range as in I have to do the next teleport outside of that range, we're now going to find out. No better way than as I learn, you learn. That's what life is all about, sharing of knowledge. So we'll figure this out anyway. Oh. Oh, I did die for my for, for the first time. I got attacked by a fox and a bear, and because I was so hungry to get the claws and all of that, and oh, and a goblin free I was attacked by, and yep, I uh, scared two of them off, but the bear killed me. But bears are my favourite things to hunt because they don't run away. See, I mean, look at that. I, you know, I could have killed him before he got to me if I was probably better at uh, playing with the combat. But I'll get there. It's all about practicing. So let's look at the map. How far have I got to go to get out of that zone? Okay, a bit further. So I want to do a teleport to the right. Now, with the buildings, I noticed you're as limited to how many wells you can build. I can only build two wells for my level. So if I bring up the build, let's show you, see if I can show you. Yeah, see here, reached limit for the cooking table, reached limit for the current level for the wells. So I was able to, to build two wells. I'm really hoping it's not limited with the portals, because I want to be able to place portals all over the place. I want to go portal mad. Now, all the goblins have respawned. Yeah, so I'll get a couple of hits in with the rock, finish off with the club. Why not? One thing I noticed is, when you do pull with rocks, it do not aggro the other goblins nearby. Okay, am I out of tele... Oh no, I've still got a ways to go. Nearly there, just got to kill off all these goblins. I wish they wouldn't move. Okay. Um, no, I don't want any behind me. It's a recipe for disaster. Right, okay, let's keep going. Oh, don't go to dark. For goodness sake, I want to show me making a portal. How am I going to do that if you go dark on me? Okay, so what I'm doing here is a portal all the way to the left. Um, there's a good reason for this, because over here... I hope, there's, I hope there's no creatures. Some might be dead. Oh, there is a boar, and it's going to run. Not that I can see it when it does run. Oh, it got away. Oh, well. Right, okay, so over here is where I found some copper. There's tin, and I believe some iron. 
and loads of foxes. So, I'm just on the edge. Let's try and do a portal here and see what happens. Right by all these resources. Ah, right, okay, you can. Um, let's do it just there. Oh wait, no, no there isn't. There is another portal nearby. The distance between the portals should be sufficiently large. Right, so that's what that's talking about. So I need to go just a little bit further away. Which I'm going to do once I've dealt with some of these creatures. definitely got to practice with these rocks but I do love them oh dear I think I'm gonna die ah right okay got in no you're not suffering interference with your telly or your monitor that is me with low health right what did they drop health no claws Oh well, never mind. Okay, so I need to get a little further out and then I can demonstrate this. Let's get a bit of health back. so good that there's loads of apple trees because in the early game apples really are your saviour and strawberries um, but of course we are going to develop a much better food called chocolate and that's another episode and that's going to be a good one right I think one more apple and I should be good to go yeah that's good enough right so I'm nearly out of the range over here should be oh no a little bit more to the right of course there's all these resources on top of this hill as well oh, oh well he won't much bother ok so I'm going to need to go over here with the portal Right, that should be it. Let's create ourselves a portal. Oh, enemies by nearby. Oh well, you're learning all of this as well. I need to kill this boar. Come on, I got it then. Surely I did. Surely I got that ball. They're all running down there. No, look, there they go. See, they're all scurrying off together. Oh. You see how lucky these creatures are. Right, well, now let's see if I can do my portal. Just there. There we go. Right, so it doesn't take long at all to make. There we go, quest completed. At last. Wow, that was a big quest, long quest to do. Right, so let's do use this portal. 
Now, the first thing I'm wondering is, has it capped me on the amount of portals I can make? No. Oh, that is just beautiful. That's awesome. Because that means I can spread portals all over. Uh, so a logical name for this is not the name of a planet, but where its location is. So I'm going to call this South East. There we go, because that's where it is. Oh no, I don't want to start the game from that point. Okay, so now we just click on my base. And there we are, instantly back in my base. How cool is that? And if we want to go back, we click on this, and then southeast. Is that not seriously cool? Just imagine, right? I've hardly mapped any of this world out. I don't know how big the world is, but this has been my domain of travel. Just this little bit here. Where it's dark, I've not been yet. But now, with the portals, anywhere is possible. But I wonder how big the world is. Apparently, there's eight different biomes. And this all appears to be one biome, so... My goodness, it's going to be a big old world full of portals made by yours truly. Okay, so now what I'm going to start working on next, because the timer hasn't gone, so I'm going to carry on. We've got our portals done. The next thing I want to do that is just so cool, I love it. The next thing I want to do now is take care of animals, as in fencing them in, because I'm sick of running after them. Now, to do this, I've made um, loads of planks. Yeah, let's grab that. And some nails. I really need to do a couple of hundred nails, but, you know, gathering iron, I'm chewing through the iron. Uh, but it's all good, so let's get loads of planks, planks and nails, that's roughly what we're going to be needing in order to build this, uh, what I want to do. And I thought that I'll put the animals over this side here, I think. I'm not sure how big to make it, that's the only thing. Or maybe I should put the animals over here. Yeah, let's put the animals over here. Right, so... Okay, what I'm going to do is an enclosure for the animals. So we're going to go to decorations, and I'm going to do the big wide gate I decided in the end. You remember I was humming and hawing over that for ages and ages, but finally Treebeard made his mind up after a year or two. Okay, so there's going to be the gate, but remember, spacebar, we can swizzle the screen, and also middle mouse button, scroll wheel, will turn it around. But that works for me, being like that. Okay, I want to make sure there's a clear area. Between these torches. So let's do it there. Okay, so now we're going to need a fence around it. And I want to do the biggest fence. So four times one size. No, notice it's chewing through nails and planks. Okay, so put one there, put one there, one there. I don't want it too small. Uh, okay, now there, there, there. Why are there enemies nearby? I don't like the sound of that. Oh, it's because they're over that side. So I guess he's going to have to go over there and start killing goblins. See how simple this is, though, to build a little pen? It don't come much better than that, does it? I mean, come on, let's be honest. This is a beautiful game. 
Oh, there's the timer. I'm getting carried away, as usual. But I want to finish. Oh, I need to do a smaller pen. As a smaller fence uh, by two. There we go. Look at that. Check me out. Check out my pen. Okay, so how do we open the gate? We do the space bar on there, click gate, and it swings open. Now what I want to do is get my two animals. I'm going to get a lot more than that, I can assure you. So Mr. Chicken, or Mrs. Chicken, I should say. And Mr. Cockerel, Mr. Rooster. Okay, now that they're following me, let's take him over here. Oh, did I make it deep enough to lead them in? Yeah, cool, look at that. There we go. So as all I'm missing now is a cow and a sheep and a goat. Maybe I should put, I'm going to put that rooster further away, I think, because he's going to keep roostering all the time at me, or crowing. There we go. Now, they're not going to wander off anymore. There we go. Happy little animals. Right, wherever you are in the world, God bless you, and keep every last one of you safe. Thank you for watching, and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.